Hi, Ray from Bridge Marina here. I want to provide some uh, quick, basic, but safe tips on connecting your boat trailer to your truck or car. Uh, first thing is I want to make sure I have the right size coupler and ball. Uh, typically on top of your coupler, it'll tell you this one is two inch. And I know I got my two inch here in my multi-coupler on my truck. I want to get myself uh, centered right underneath the coupler. I'm going to bring it on down there. If I'm off a little, it doesn't matter too much, because usually I can nudge or bring that thing right on. I'm seeing it's fitting really tight between that ball and the socket and latch it over. I'm not going to put it all the way down yet because I'm going to test it in a minute. But I want to make sure I connect everything and it's secure. Here is my emergency brake line for my trailer. Got my safety chains and I've crossed them so that if it fell off, it would cradle it and catch it going down the road. And my third is my lights. I always like to my lights because the uh, lights don't always work. Break out my knife and just clean my connections real quick. Make sure there's nothing in there. And this, I have a, a little extra line here, so I'm going to wrap around to make sure they don't fall apart. Nice and secure. Finally, I've got my coupler safety pin. Throw that in. And a quick test I always like to do is, I mentioned I have my trailer jack down yet, so I like to lift it all the way up. I got a nice tight connection. I just tested it, stress tested it. I'm good to go. Um, after this, I'm gonna check my lights. I'm gonna go around my trailer. I wanna check my tires. I wanna make sure everything's strapped down or my winch isn't loose. Just wanna do a, a general safety check before I get on the road. And I'm good to go. Finally, again, chains, brake, lights, safety, coupler. We're ready to hit the road almost. Thanks for watching.